Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. So I do apologise for the delay in videos. We have a new little addition to our little family. This is Bella, the Labradoodle crossed with a Jack Russell. Um, but yes, we got her three weeks ago and well, life has been manic. Ever since, she literally chews everything. <laughs> Are you saying hello? <laughs> um, so yeah, time to film a video has just not happened at all. Um, so yes, if you can hear barking or various other sounds, then it will just be her. This is the second time I have tried to film this video because the first time was a total disaster. And she was chewing everything, all of my clothes. So yeah, we're gonna try again, take two. So today, I'm just gonna be showing you the last few little pieces I've picked up for my holiday. Um, I go next Saturday and I've never been so excited for a holiday ever. So I've totally made the most of not going away last year and bought like triple the amount of clothes I need. But everything in the shops is so nice this year and a lot of the stuff I have bought is not my typical summer wear. So I feel like I've done good. There's a lot of colour and there's not much black at all or grey or white for that matter. It's all quite colourful. So yeah, there's quite a few places um, as you would have seen by the title. So I am gonna start just with the things where there's just a few little pieces. Um, the first, this is gonna be a try on haul so you will get to see what everything looks on, looks like on fully. Um, so you cannot really see this bodysuit but it's just a ribbed white bodysuit from Zara. Um, it's quite low at the back and quite low at the front. Um, so that's the first thing. That was 12 99 And then the second thing from Zara, oh no I didn't, I got this from H&M. Yes, H&M. It's just this little um, headband with the little knot in the front. Not, I'm not going to try it on because haven't quite mastered how you wear it yet but um yeah I think this was 3 99 instead of the one from Zara which I think was about 7 99 so I thought ooh, I thought I would just try this for again holiday maybe on days where I've got my hair up um so yeah I thought I'd give that a try um the second place I will do is misguided so one of the things has just been pulled out the washing machine because obviously I washed it so it is still wet but it's just this very oversized black t-shirt that has Chicago written on the front um I thought this would be perfect to go with my cycling shorts Yes, I know this trend is not liked by everybody, maybe even myself, because I've tried them on and it doesn't look quite like what I thought it was going to, but I'm just going to wear them anyway because everybody else seems to pull them off, other than myself, so I don't know if it's just psychological. But yes, I just got these ones from, oh I'm saying these are from Misguided, they're actually not. This t-shirt's from Pretty Little Thing, as are the cycling shorts. The t-shirt was £10, I think, and the cycling shorts were 12 I think, because these are the slinky ones. Yeah, the high-waisted slinky cycling shorts. So they're like the shiny material. Um, I, I can't remember if I just said, I think these were £12. Um, so I thought I'd just give those a try together. Um, one thing I did get from Misguided was this pink and white and red very long t-shirt dress. I just thought this would be nice to throw on on days where I don't necessarily want to think too much into an outfit. I thought this would be cute with just a pair of trainers, um, dead cash and it's really soft as well and I think this was £12 I think could be wrong. I will try and link everything down below because all of it is fairly new so this should have everything still in stock. 
Um, the last place I went where I just got one little item was Urban Outfitters. And I just got this little, are they called Hessian? Or straw? Not really sure. Just a little black bag which is quite open. Like it's just got a little popper. Not a zip so I mean it's not great for if somebody wants to steal anything. But this was £20 reduced from 29 so I thought I've seen quite a few of these around and they look quite cute so I thought I'd just treat myself to one of those. Um, next place I will do is New Look. I seen these little sandals which are just brown suede material. Um, these were $17.99 but they had 30% off. They have 30% off so much in New Look at the minute. It's not normally a place that I would go but um, there's a one Hey, there's a one near me um, on the retail park that I live near and I thought I'd just pop in to see if they had anything like sandals and things and there was 30% off so can't really go wrong and they're so comfortable. This bit's really good and as is this bit. Excuse me, do you mind? Do you mind? Right. The next thing is also from New Look, but New Look men's section. And it's just this, again, oversized white t-shirt that has this on the front. Um, this was only 9 99 and I got 20% student discount. I'm not a student, but I lent my friends a student card, which took it down to like 7 99 um, But I thought again with my cycling shorts, this would look really cute and $7.99 for an oversized tee. Men's t-shirts are the way forward when it comes to oversized because every time I get a woman's oversized it still fits like a woman's. I know that sounds so obvious but men's t-shirts just fit so much nicer and they're very flattering. I just prefer them all around really. So yeah that's everything from New Look. I will move on to Topshop now. The first thing I got were these denim shorts. So every year I tend to get my shorts from Topshop if I'm going away or for whatever reason. In the summer I will always go to Topshop just because I know that they fit nicely and they're not too expensive and they do last quite a while. But um, over the years I've either grown out of them or decided I didn't like them and want a different style so I find myself buying denim shorts all the time well every summer not all the time so I have had these ones before but last time I got them they had rips on the bottom bit as well and I got them when I was like 17 so you don't really mind when you're 17 but I mean now that I'm 21 I'm not really that fussed about having my arse out on show all the time so I thought these were a lot more what's the word I don't really know but anyways they only have rips in the front and they are high-waisted they are the mom style shorts and I already own a pair of jeans like this so I know that I like the fit of them um, and I got these in a size 10 these were 32 pound I think um, again, I had my friend's student card, so I got a little bit of discount. And I also got from Topshop this little stripy t-shirt, which just says happy on the front in some nice little pink sparkly thread. Um, and it's just, it's very different for me, lots of colours. But yeah, it's super soft and it's super soft. I got this in a size 12. I think that was, I think I probably should have got a 10, but I don't think there was one. And I'm not a person to order in. I'm just too impatient. So yeah, I think this was 14 pound or 16 pound. I'm not too sure. To go with that top or to go with a white top uh, or anything else, I got this denim skirt, which is also from Topshop. This was 29 pound and I got it in a size 10. Um, it's just a basic red A-line skirt basically. It's got a little bit of thread around the bottom as well. So yeah, thought this was really cute and very out of my comfort zone. So proud of me. The final place I went was Primark and this is where I don't understand how 
Topshop can charge £29. I do love it, love it, no, not complaining. Primark, exactly, no word of a lie, exactly the same skirt. In white, obviously. Is it going to focus? £8. £8. But yeah, just a white one, just to switch things up a little bit. And yes, it was £8. Also got this in a size 10. Can't go wrong. The next thing I was overly happy about finding, it was this pale pink. As you can see, I'm quite obsessed with pink this season. Pale pink denim jacket, which I got in a size 12, so it is slightly oversized, but it is still quite fitted and structured, so like, you can tell where your sho like the shoulders aren't droopy and stuff like that. Um, and it's just got rips various different places on the jacket and some little pockets and I think this was £15 which if you went somewhere else you would pay a hell of a lot more um, I just thought this would be nice to throw on with a pair of black jeans or even blue jeans um, just in the summer because all I wear is my blue denim jacket which I'm still yet to bring to the flat I think it's still at my dad's house but yeah I thought for £15 I would try and brighten my jacket my range of jackets up with that so yes £15 bargain not much else I can say about it the next thing are these sunglasses which look like this not really sure if I've decided if I suit them yet but I seen some in Urban Outfitters whilst I was in buying that bag and they were £14 and I was like mm, I'm pretty sure Primark will do something like that which I was right and they're basically exactly the same but these are £2 so yeah I'm not even if they, if they don't look nice on my face they look nice on my head and they don't have those stupid little things which my well I don't think they're up there my Ray-Bans have the little nose pads that when you do that they get stuck in your hair which I find really irritating but I love them so obviously still wear them. So yeah that's them I'm just going to try and wear them as well because I like them. The last two pieces are just some jammy shorts or pyjama shorts. The first pair, these are also from Primark, are just some white and blue stripy ones. I got these in a medium and they were £2.50. And the final pair are just these little black ones with frills around the bottom. And I also got these in a medium and again they were £2.50. So these are just to throw on when I'm getting ready and stuff in the hotel. So yeah, I think, I think that's everything. I do hope that you enjoyed this video. Um, I'm not promising that another one will be up before I go. Um, I go on the 12th of May so I'm not promising another one will be up because I've got quite a busy week next week um, and like I said life with a puppy is quite tiring to say the least so yeah this one will be uploaded when you so it's Thursday today it will be up uploaded tonight fingers crossed if I do get my outfits filmed um, then when I go away, I will be filming a lot because I will have a cameraman. Hallelujah. So yes, if you do have any ideas, just please comment them below of what you would like to see when I'm, when I'm in Italy. Um, so yeah, I do hope that you enjoyed this video and I'll link everything that I can remember or find down below and it'll also be linked on my 21 buttons which I will also link down below and you can follow us on that too. So yeah, see you soon, bye!